So fortunately, G was here at his house in North Wales. It's a lovely place. Look at that view. <laughs> series, last round, uh, Revolution's only half an hour away, right? so thought we'd go and have a look. Van's in again for more work, so we've got a little car, hence why Todd's holding the camera right now. Uh, it is Todd, isn't it? You're not, you're not Tracy. Is it, is it, what's your name? Todd Nold. Very quiet this morning, all right. Uh, and Todd's going to watch some of the fastest downhills in the country. Yeah, Andrew. Hello, how's your uh, not enduro going? Better than enduro. You were fastest yesterday, weren't you, in your impactless category? <laughs> this is Doc, our expert um, editor of the vlogs. So, my radio mechanic was Taylor Vernon, and also we've got Kate Edwards, who's on the development team. Yeah. And this is Will Sawyer. Uh, he is pretty handy down here as well, I must say. I've ridden with him at Bike Park Wales, um, definitely doesn't hang about. Have you got your work cut out today here? Is this going to be a bit of a bike breaker? Or? Uh, well, considering we just came off Mont St Anne, today's, yeah. uh, today's actually a bit more chilled. Okay. Um, Kate's done a few bits, but yeah, not as, not as many as usual. So that's a good sort of half day we've had there. We've done the seeding, it's good to see uh, Coop come in. Fastest senior, his first downhill race in years. Uh, I think he was third fastest in the experts. It's even better, fair play to him. Uh, we're not gonna stay, well the rain came down, the weather's a bit better about now, but we're not gonna stay, we're gonna go and see. We're we gonna go and hopefully see now. Yeah. yeah. Todd's little buddy up there, <laughs> um, go and hook up with him, um, see what he's got to say, look at some bits and pieces. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers all the way. So fortunately, G was here at his house in North Wales, which is a lovely place, look at that view, spot on. Not bad. So, uh, nice hedge Todd. Views yeah. that way, views that way, <laughs> that's the view. There it is. We just have to point this and just show the, pass the camera, we'll just show the awesome camera guy. <laughs> there he is. <laughs> Shows your camera skills. You prefer to be behind the camera, don't you, Todd? So, um, we've just been to Revolution. How come you didn't decide not to ride there? It's not up for it. Yeah, I was thinking of it. It is 10 minutes away, so I felt like I should, but to be honest, we've got some big races coming up. We've got the World Cup in Andorra, we've got World Champs, yeah. Father Soul, and then uh, Hardline the weekend after. Yeah. And then Red Bull Fox Hunt over in Ireland. Yes, I might be coming to that really? to race you. Oh, they've contacted me out. about, well, they contacted us about Rachel's one, which we're sending someone, mm. girl, to that. And I think I'm going to be doing the one with you. So I'm going to kick you off. Come show the barge in me. Bring it on. Yeah. <laughs> Mate, there's going to be like 200 angry Irish men in there. It's I know, going to be, yeah, It's yeah. going to be wild. It's just going to be carnage everywhere. Yeah, wow. But yeah, we've got some big races coming up, so I thought, you know, a weekend off. I'm yeah. not worried about missing the, the VDS. It's not been a big one for me this year, so. Right, okay. Chilling. And what about your rallying? How's that going? Yeah, it's going all right, yeah. yeah. It's just a bit of fun, you know. And yeah. it's something we've tried to kind of squeeze into three weekends, but it's been, it's been a good season, and uh, I think it's like I'm looking to do a bit more of it, but yeah, still. Do you think you could actually maybe one day be a rally star? Do you think you've got what it takes? <laughs> no. No? No, I don't know, but you know, for me it's still all about the mountain biking. Yeah. It's just, I just do it for fun, you know. It's awesome sitting in a rally car, going sideways around a forest, but I mean, 
yeah, yeah. for me it's all about the mountain bike racing still and, and that's my main kind of focus then. I remember you taking me out in your last one and uh, yeah, that sort of terrified me slightly. <laughs> Do you remember that? <laughs> I don't know if it's a compliment or not really, yeah. probably not. <laughs> but um, So also you got this thing, uh, Dovey, well I say you, it's more, I know it's more after your brother, uh, I guess you guys are involved in it as well. Um, how's things coming along with that? What's the plans? And... Yeah, it's um, it's a little project Dan's been working on. Yeah. In, in Chuathi fashion, it's it's gone absolutely enormous. It's just yeah. the bike park he's working on. You know, the idea's been there for quite a while, been in the pipeline, and this year he's just really taken off with it. It's just a huge area of land that he's been lucky enough to kind of work with the guys to, well, create a bike park, basically. Do you think next year that will completely take over for him from Enduro? Uh, it won't take over, no, but it'll definitely, you know, it's going to be a big part of, of what he does. I yeah. mean, at the moment it's kind of just t kicking off and, you know, we've been riding it a lot and doing a lot of filming there and it's, you know, hands down one of the best places I've ever ridden in the, in the really? UK and, you know, it's only half finished, so it's going to be incredible, but, you know, Athi still wants to keep racing and, you know, there's time to do both. There's going to be a real mix for him and, yeah. you know, that, that dude works so hard. It's not a problem for him to, to tackle both things. How many hours is he putting in a day doing that? Oh, it's ridiculous. Really? Yeah. Is he it's, working it's himself into hours. the ground? No, he, he, he works well, but I mean, he, he goes hard. Like, he, he's going to stay at his house and you'll get up in the morning and he's gone, you know. He's, he's gone before it's light. Yeah, he's yeah. He's back when it's dark. And long, long days. And he's got a good crew helping him as well, which is pretty important. Right. Is he having to pay them a lot, or is it um, a mate's thing? Oh, you'd have to ask him. Yeah. <laughs> But they're working hard, so they must be yeah, getting something from it. Yeah. And you're downhilling. How's your downhilling going actually in the World Cup this year? Um, you had a bit of bad luck. Crashes here. Yeah, it's gone all right. It's been an okay season, but yeah, like you say, it's some pretty heavy crashes. Yeah. Which is, you know, it's difficult to get through the season and not kind of drop form when you're having big offs that are kind of setting you back. I was lucky enough to kind of be able to ride with the injuries, but yeah, when you just lose, you know. A small percentage of your performance you soon kind of kicked off the, the, the steps of those podiums so it's been a tough year but not a bad one no yeah yeah and everything sort of looking the same for next year or different sponsors or do you not really no we're still with trek for next year for right. sure yeah we're still with okay. trek working uh, working a lot with them on, on bikes and you know some ideas about stuff you know next year and it's cool to be with those guys and they, they love the racing as much as we do so yeah, you know, they're always looking at ways to make the bike faster, make it lighter, always improve it, and it's it's been quite refreshing to work with them. This year. And what about your sort of routes around here, around Shrewsbury? Obviously, being from Shrewsbury myself, we've got lots of mates around there. You're still enjoying it around there. You're getting yeah. out a bit around Shrewsbury. Yeah, Shrewsbury's still a place to be. Yeah, we're about three or four weeks away from the end of, end of the race season, so looking we'll have to have to a bigger, won't we? Looking forward to some off-season time in the in nice. Shrewsbury in the nags. Alright, awesome. Cheers dude. Nice one mate. Take it easy. It's a nice Thanks. day today. Great to go to see the see the racing. Um, go and see G. It's always good to see G. We like G. Uh, you like G don't you? It's like your little mate and he Todd likes looking around the place, looking at his rally car and looking at all the tricks trick stuff. And I feel G gets a lot of sort of um, does get a bit of bad press here and there, people saying he's like a bit arrogant or a bit too factory and he really really isn't like that when you know him he's such a nice lad I got a lot of time for him and he was kind enough to give us a time to have that little interview good to see him good to have a great day out on it So like, like us, share us, no, oh, bollocks, <laughs> cut. Uh. Right, it's like and subscribe to our channel, MTB. <laughs> 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 <laughs>